Not in the way. Yep. Guidance is touch. Yeah. Expeditious retreat's a bonus action, so I can cast that. Oh yeah, nice. And then I can get over to him. Mm -hmm. Which one's a bonus action? Expeditious retreat. Nice. I didn't know that. I didn't know that either. Are you sure it's a bonus action or does it grant you a bonus I'm looking action? at it right now. Casting time. One bonus action. Nice. Yep, that's what I have to see. Bonus. Woot. When you cast this spell, then as a bonus action on each of your turns until the end of the spell, you can take the dash action. Yep. Uh, so it, I guess on your first turn you wouldn't be able to, though. No, it's not going to do anything either. All right, I guess so, I'm going to give you a little bonus. When you cast the spell and on subsequent turns. Yeah, but I don't think it gives me an extra bonus action. It yeah, it does say action. when you cast this so, spell and then yeah. as a bonus action. Yeah, so you do get right. so you cast the spell and that, you, in addition to casting it as a bonus action, you also get the expeditious movement. And then in future ones, you have to spend a bonus action again to get it again. It looks and, right. And the guard is down, right? The guard is twitching. Yeah, the guard is twitching. All right, well, I'm going to go over to Ramus. He's doing the same thing I am, probably. I'll cast expeditious retreat. I'll move over to Ramus. And I will try to to stabilize him, I guess. Okay. Medicine check. It's just a 50, 50 shot at minimum. You got this. Yeah. Right. Negative. Stabilized. Tiny, don't you leave me! I need you! <laughs> All right. So you're still unconscious, but you're not dying. Yep, still unconscious, not dying. All right, so this guy... He like he like stands up. He's like he's like fucked up. He's like please please, I, I give up. Don't I just fuck? And he like kind of like just sits down. What this guy? Yeah, yeah. So we're pretty much out of turns. So I'll just uh, blast to the face. All right, he goes down. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what about last uh, one? Captain Insano yeah. shows no mercy. All right, so just anything you're going to quickly do right now, um, it'll also we'll finish it next session. So is ASDF already dead? Yeah, yeah. No, he, got, he got he got. He's like, he's like, oh, yeah, you said Ash, right, right. He's a burning corpse. Then I guess, yeah, other than just like making sure, <laughs> making sure I have all of my stuff and not just like, you know, the, the dagger or whatever. Um, that's about it. Okay. Right, well, I guess that if there's anything else that looks cool and useful in this room. <laughs> All right, yeah, might... what we should be focused on right now. Running is key. Yeah, well, getting things to help you run or, or healing potions. Yeah, I'll well, probably do that yeah. next session too. Yeah. yeah. All right, so yeah. Um, so yeah, we're going to leave off with you guys in this room <laughs> um, with the orb floating in the center. Dude, I can't believe you told him to grab it. Like. <laughs> Well, I wasn't I, sure if it was an last explosion time, or not. Yeah, based on last time, I was like, okay, so it probably like fucks the touch, fucks the wearer with like a a line of lightning bolt or something like that. I wasn't aware it was going to be like a twenty foot explosion of lightning. It's actually like a thirty foot, and it's like the <laughs> arcs that go out of it. I was just going to ask. So is it? Is it less than down. thirty feet? <laughs> <laughs> because if so, I could mage hand it. Nice. Uh, I, I, what uh, that is thirty feet. Out, out, out of game. What spell is on there? It's a. It's it's like a form of chain lightning. Okay. I mean, basically, JJ is okay with the idea of making up spells in this campaign. He's already said. Right. So. Yeah. This is sort of a meta fireball chain lightning. Whatever. Right. <laughs> All right, guys. I got a call to run too, so I gotta get off. Right. Well, we All totally right. ri got railroaded, I guess. JJ, I was expecting a slightly different pathway. <laughs> See you, Martin. JJ See was you, Martin. probably expecting something entirely different than that, right? Well, yeah. I mean, uh, no, I was gonna make it pretty much where you guys like had to fight to get out and stuff. But, like, I didn't expect it to be this rough because I didn't expect you all to get, like, split up and just run around randomly and <laughs> be, like, fighting, like, onesies and twosies trying to survive. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so the expectation you had was that we would all be in the room, a one guard would be left, we'd get out, fight the guard, and run, right, as a, as a team or something. Right, and then, like, have to, like, figure out as a team how to, like, you know, get through. Well, I mean, you're not done yet. 
Like, right, right, yeah, yeah, I know. So, but then it was like, oh, two people leave, then one person fights, <laughs> then two more people run away. <laughs> right, and then Nash fights all by himself and gets smoked. Like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and then, then Durga turns into a guard and walks away. Then yeah. Lorcan runs and meets up with two other people. Yeah. Right. So yeah, I mean, it's it's still not going to be like. It's I mean, not there's a still game. a giant and a djinn upstairs, yeah. presumably looking for us. Yeah. So. There better be some healing potions down here. Or I'm out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Got so just have Lorcan tank with. Yeah, you should just tell John before next session with their healing potions, because we have no healing. So if there aren't, he's unconscious for 1d4 hours. Oh, oh man. Rough. At which point he gets one hit point. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. yeah, it's good times. So, and I also expected to, like, have more of, like, a kind of like a, like a conversation where you guys, like, kind of like find out what happened. But which isn't going to happen now, so I'm just going to tell you mentally. <laughs> um, pretty much, like, he, like, the, you guys did make the trade, um, but, um, you know, and Grand Lot went in and stuff, but it was his hideout, like, the guy's hideout, so he has, like, a, like, an evacuation tunnel, and, like, the guard, or the guy at the front door, like, sounded, it was able to sound the alarm, so he was able to make it out. And he kind of like started hunting you guys down, and um, I know this is like pretty much like GM, you know, like dropping animals, but um, you know he eventually caught you all, and like the genie like kind of like replaced your old memories, so you don't like remember them being like you know hunt, you don't remember being hunted down and stuff. Um, that's a uh, so. that, that's a pretty high level spell, guys. I wouldn't fuck with that gin. He's uh. He's like the equivalent of a 14th level wizard or something like that. Well, so also uh, like in this campaign, um, sometimes some people are able to have a lot smaller like spell kind of like focus, but are able to like cast it as like. But as all right, sweet JJ saying he's not 14th level. Let's fuck him up. Like <laughs> I mean, it would be pretty impossible for you guys to fight a 14th level. Right, but but that especially makes sense when it's a like another species or whatever. Like they could have whatever racial ability, it doesn't mean they have the full class. Right. Here. Like he only does stuff like focused on like sleep, dreams, confusion, and mind stuff. Like that's all he does. So. Mm -hmm.